Now help me welcome to the stage, Terry Joe. No, what I think is hilarious because I was raised by grandma who believed the Ku Klux Klan owned everything. Like I couldn't drink Snapple. She like, don't drink Snapple, baby. The Klan owns it. Mm -mm. How to get my start stand up actually came down to this club, the Pittsburgh Improv when I was 18, right out of high school. Uh, as a teenager, I always wanted to come to this club and perform. Um, this is a club that many people have touched the stage from Chris Rock to Dave Chappelle. So it was always a dream of mine to try stand up. I always told people since I was a teen, I was gonna do it. Power Rangers was the most racist show on television, man. The Red Ranger was Native American. The Yellow Ranger was Asian. And the Black Ranger was black, but not any black, but stereotypical black. Like his favorite food was chicken. He was the fastest dude on the track team. And instead of fighting, he was always dancing. I'm always <laughs> You're the only character with a gun, use it. I don't know how to describe it. I think it's, uh, it's crazy. I think it's energetic sometimes. I think there's times where it's uh, depressing. I think there's times where it's just uh, very truthful. Uh, the impressions are always what a lot of people love. You know you like that magic stick. Take your ass to the candy shop. Uh -huh. Always just wanted to be myself and be funny. So pretty much my comedy style is me. Um, my biggest comedic influences are Richard Pryor. Um, actually, when I was in 10th grade, I was going through some things, um, and my dad bought a box set of Richard Pryor, and I burned all the CDs into one MP3 CD, and that's when MP3 CD players were big, and uh, I listened to every single album. Uh, that was a very big influence on me. The other one is Bill Cosby, because he's just hilarious in what he did for black comedy as a whole. Um, and Eddie Murphy. Eddie Murphy's a very big comedy influence on me because of the impressions and uh, the energy he had and it was just about making people laugh. It wasn't just about thinking. I date older women, it's just if they got kids my age or older, that's like a cutoff, you know what I'm saying? We probably shouldn't be dating. How am I gonna tell another grown ass man to go to bed if you have a son, you know what I mean? I did a show in a college where nobody spoke English and the audience uh, stared at us except when you cursed or whenever I did impressions because that's international. So if I did 50 Cent, I was like, yeah, yo, yo, Sam, 50 Cent in the building. All the kids, ah, yes, it's 50 Cent, ah, yeah. It was, it was awkward, man. It was weird. You will get mad when people are talking and heckling because no heckler has ever saved the show. I mean, you can feed off of that if you're really good, but some people, you know, for newer guys that don't know how to handle that, it's rough. Uh, the way I handle it is I just go, hey, it is what it is. You guys are walking out. That's nice. Goodbye. See you guys. You guys out of here. Bye. Did you pay your check first? Just checking. Okay. Usually people get the check and that make them run like $60 for a yingling. F this. I'm out. I actually do like doing sketch comedy a lot. Um, I got a couple viral videos on YouTube that are, some are really big, some are, you know, uh, kind of big. Um, that part I love doing because you can express yourself as different characters. Uh-huh, you know what it is. Jello pudding, jello pudding, jello pudding, jello pudding. Yeah, uh-huh, you know what it is. Jello pudding, jello pudding, jello pudding, jello pudding. Those YouTube videos help me out um, for myself. It helps me have fun and not get down when things aren't happening for me. And it also helps the public know who I am, especially when the videos hit viral. I like black porn, but I kind of don't. The only reason I don't like it is because the music's always way too good in black porn, you know what I'm saying? Like instead of masturbating, I'm always dancing to it. Like, oh my God, this soundtrack is great. Is that the electric slide? I'm about the Cupid shuffle. In five years, I, I will have been doing comedy for 11 years. Um, I would like to see myself having my own sketch comedy show, not a mediocre 
a sketch comedy show like some stand-ups have just because they have a name. I want to have something really fun, really funny for the people that helps excel other careers and the people that I know and I care about. And I also want to be one of those guys that everybody knows and remembers. Uh, and people, whenever they hear about Terry Jones, I want them to say, hey, you know, Terry Jones is a very funny guy. Terry Jones is very uh, influential. Uh, Terry Jones is a household name. Uh, Terry Jones is who I would love to pay to see. I'm MC Terry Jones. Everyone drive home safe and have a good night. Thank you.